Hello and welcome to Lake Mariner Data, Terrell's 91% zero carbon hydro powered Bitcoin mining facility in upstate New York. I'm Chloe Turnbull, head of Terrell's digital strategy. And I'm Sean Farrell, Terrell's head of development, operations, and construction. Today, we've got some exciting news to share regarding the progress of Building 3, our latest addition of Lake Mariner, which is gearing up to accommodate approximately 13,500 of Bitmain's latest generation miners, and will add two exahash of mining capacity that will bring TerraWolf's total capacity to almost eight exahash. In addition to our construction update, we've got a few more exciting announcements that we'd like to share with you, so stay tuned for those. Thank you for joining us today for this exclusive update. Now we'll hand it over to our operations team to dive into all the details. Hello, I'm Jerry Goodenow, the project manager at this site, and I'm pleased to give you an up close look at the progress of Lake Mariner's newest mining building. Building three is made up of 24 hydro racks with nearly 13 and a half thousand miner slots in a total capacity of 45 megawatts. The building is the perfect demonstration of TerraWolf team's unique skill set. It was the first building on the site from the early 1980s from the original power plant. And over the past few months, the team has worked with local engineering firms to upgrade the building, modifying the walls and roof with static venting to optimize airflow, utilizing existing electrical infrastructure from the old power plant days to feed the building. Our construction team has displayed unwavering dedication over the last few months and have consistently remained ahead of schedule. We couldn't be more excited with the launch of this new section of our site at Lake Mariner Data. As you can see, with the foundation being built behind me, the next expansion is already underway, called Building 4, to house over 10,000 additional miners, bringing our total operation capacity to 10 exahash. How, might you ask? Let's turn it over to Gary Arneson for more details. Hello, my name is Gary Arneson, General Manager and Electrical Lead at this site. Being co-located at a retired power plant has many advantages including the ability to hire directly from the Buffalo area and local community. But most important is the dual 345 KB lines that connect to the site, served by NYSIG and NIPA. The plant was originally built for up to 700 megawatts and has two redundant GSU transformers that we're tapping into for the expansion across the buildings to come. Long lead time is typically the limiting factor, but not for us. We're repurposing the generator protection system meant originally for the power plant for data center usage, which cuts considerable lead time and utilizes an already proven system. Thanks again for joining us for this Wolf update. On screen and in the description box below, you'll find links to all of our social channels where you can follow us for future progress updates, company announcements, and more. Until next time, happy, happy mining. mining.